When the bus arrives at school, students will exit the bus one side at a time. Students will disembark starting with those closest to the front of the bus and moving back until the entire side has exited. Then the other side will repeat the same procedure. Students exiting the bus will be screened by school staff before being allowed into the building. Amidst the pandemic and trying to open up the school safely, um, we're looking at a bunch of different measures to keep our students and our staff safe. A lot of places that you go to these days, they use a, uh, a thermal thermometer, which they put to your forehead. So with having volume of students come in, um, we needed to find a better way so we don't bottleneck the students and we can still social distance. Uh, so I went and uh, purchased some thermal imaging devices uh, from a company called Night Owl. And there will be two of these set up in the lobby of or at the entranceway for every school. And what it does is it can monitor up to 10 temperatures per uh, device per second. What we're really looking for is we're looking for um, students that come in with a temperature. Mm -hmm. And what will happen is it will actually capture that student's photograph here on the screen. So um, a staff member can you know, guide that student to the side should they have a temperature that's above the CDC uh, recommended guidelines. How many um, temperatures per second can this device monitor? Uh, this unit can handle 10 simultaneous infrared reads. So that's 10 students per second or 10 adults, uh, whatever that you know quantity is. And we'll have two of these in each lobby. So uh, we'll be able to get 20 students per second, um, get their temperatures captured. And you know, if we have a, a high temperature, we'll definitely, we'll definitely be able to detect that. Good morning, Kiara. Hey, dear C, good morning, Veron. Good morning, Judge Riel. Thank you for joining us today.
Hi, my name is Craig Glass, Director of Operations. And what I want to show you is another uh, safety feature that we've been uh, taking care of here in the district is, uh, this is what's called a unit ventilator. And it's the primary source of fresh air uh, to come in the building. Obviously, CD CDC guidelines strongly recommending that you have proper ventilation. What we've done is we've cleaned all these units up, uh, replaced all the filters, and we do that on a regular schedule. And it is our primary intake. And as the weather changes and we start to get warm out, we also have most of our classroom windows are you know, available to be open to get additional, additional fresh air into the building. So that's a big help, and, and it's, it's strongly suggested that uh, these are steps that schools take to make it safe. On behalf of the Harrisburg School District Administration, faculty, and staff, welcome back to school. 